couldn't solve a question, what advice would you give me so I wouldn't get um, discouraged about not being able to solve that question? Oh, what a great question. Well, that's very good. Well, you know, life is full of questions we can't solve exactly. In fact, one of the greatest disservices we do to students like you, and this will happen throughout your career, which I'm sure will be a wonderful one, is that we, we give students these questions that they can always solve, or they're always supposed to be able to solve anyway. And it gives them the illusion that all problems are solvable. But the minute you get out in the real world, whether you're a scientist or, or anything, you find that questions aren't exactly solvable. And the trick becomes how to take a question that you can't solve and turn it into a question you can. And that's the exciting thing. Because often there's a reason you can't solve that problem. And if you understand the reason why you can't solve that problem, you can turn it into a problem you can solve. And then you can get the satisfaction of moving in a new direction. So every brick wall you encounter can be walked around. And just remember that, that there's nothing that stops you from eventually going around it to find the answer. And ultimately, the key thing to remember when it comes to brick walls and the people who provide brick walls for you, the only advice I give to young people when they ask me, you know, what's your advice? I'm a young physicist. My advice is always the same. Don't let the bastards get you down. Thank you. Thank you. Baby and me. Thank you. Up on the screen when you know who